you so much for staying tuned. If you're just joining us, this is Entertainment News on Channels Television. Where else would you rather be? Celebrating the spirit of African creativity and unity, the Afropolis Festival in Lagos transforms the city into a vibrant hub of art, culture, and innovation. It's a nine-day event that started on the 26th of October and is still ongoing. It brings together artists, innovators, and visitors from around the globe as it launches here in the nation's commercial capital, Lagos, Southwest Nigeria. Check it out. I'd like to recognize the Honorable Commissioner for Women Affairs and Poverty Alleviation, Mrs. Cecilia Bola. The highly anticipated 10-day festival that showcases and celebrates music, art, innovation and community dubbed and Afropolis no 2024 launches in grand style in Lagos, the nation's commercial capital. The festival is supported by the Lagos State Ministry of Tourism, Arts and Culture. So the applause is not for me, it's for everyone. The event kicks off with energetic music, dance and drama performances that set the stage ablaze, showcasing the diversity and richness of African culture. At the launch, the Deputy Governor of Lagos State, Obafemi Hamzat, underscores the significance of this festival as a vibrant celebration of our culture and a reminder of our history, through which he believes we can strengthen our present and shape a brighter future. So this festival has become a unique gathering for us, a melting point of ideas where tradition and modernity converge, where we believe the past made the future. Because the future is, come, is here, but we must also remember our past and see if there is an intersection. That's the best way for us to remember who we are. This festival celebrates that spirit, the spirit of a people who do not only adapt to change but drive it, who turns challenges into opportunities and who transform raw talent into global impact. Afropolis Lagos is an event that testifies to the boundless energy, talent and potential that resides within our creative industries. So to our artists, our writers, our filmmakers, our musicians, and creators who are with us today and who intends to be with us today, I urge you to embrace the challenge of this year's team. Use your craft to shape the myths that will define our future. Let your imagination soar. Let your creativity break free of the familiar. And let your stories in all their diversity become the new myths of Africa. The heart of Afropolis lies in its commitment to fostering community and throughout the day, thought-provoking discussions ignite a powerful call to action, urging collaborations that champion African creativity and elevate local talent. It's really about me. It's not really about my vision. It's about the power of great collaboration. It didn't really occur to me that the theme or the motto for the current Lagos administration is the Pile Eko. I'm sorry, Agriga Eko. Okay, I rephrase. Ibega Ipile Eko. So Ajumoshe Bugua actually means collaboration. We have to learn collaboration. As the event draws to a close, the atmosphere buzzes with excitement for what's to come. The launch of Afropolis lays the groundwork for future events that are set to inspire and connect. <laughs>